really should be a night of football to look forward to here at the home of Manchester City. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. It is Manchester City facing FC Copenhagen. Well, Derek, it's said that semi-finals are the best games to win and the worst to lose. And while the hosts are clear favourites, I still think this could be a great match, full of individual battles, a lot of passion and great skill as well. City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Nathan Ake plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Fernando Silva plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Erling Haaland. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, it's a 4 3 3 with two out and out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. And so the match is underway. Return to De Bruyne. Kevin De Bruyne has moved away from the flank. It was on its way in. Hola. A textbook interception. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. Later in the game, he might have seen yellow, but not at this early point. Yeah, but I'm with the referee. It's a foul, but no card. certainly no doubt about the finish he really hits it with power and accuracy nothing the keeper can do about that on they go again a wake-up call for the city players maybe can they find a response now Holland. And 
the ball with De Bruyne and he's making progress and he's in and the goal an end to end game and they weren't behind the ball well here it is again and I don't expect keepers to save everything at their near post but I think he should probably do better he'll be a little bit disappointed with that situation. Can he find someone at the far post? And stopping the danger. De Bruyne. Silva. Phil Foden. De Bruyne now. Making sure nothing came of it. Pass on. Promising looking ball. See what they have in store for them on the break.
themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. minutes of stoppage time here. Holland. Ronaldo Silva. And the tilt to De Bruyne. The challenge that was required. And so the half-time whistle is sounded here in Manchester. And so much to like about the first half performance put in by Kevin De Bruyne. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. So the match has restarted here in Manchester.
last 20 minutes. Mateo Kovacic. De Bruyne. That's a good looking pass. Nicely timed tackle. this evening. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So the current scoreline, 4-2. And so into the final five minutes. Well, this is looking promising. Opportunity here. Vital intervention. Oh, 
reversal, Manchester City will carry a lead with them into the second leg of this tie. Yeah, they controlled so much of the game. They got good service into the front players, they used the wide area as well, and their midfield players made some dynamic forward runs. They're certainly giving themselves a great chance of reaching the final now. Well, as you can see, our cameras are lingering on Erling Haaland. Yet another exceptional performance to add to the growing list. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course, he scored two really good goals.